Hello everyone and welcome to my Neuro Bay Farms I'm here in Stardew Valley. My name is Melanie B. Thanks for joining me today. It is the 25th of fall in year number three. Okay, let's grab our coffee and our Jocha Cola. Nope, that's a sewing machine. And we got two pieces of iridium, which is the least we can get. Hello, baby. Let's go say hello to our wife if she is in here. No, she's probably outside. Okay, so I got these kegs, and I think I'm going to go put them down in the basement right now. We can double check how much fruit we have stored. So I think I'm going to put it in on this side. So we've got 15 more to add. Yeah, I think that should just about fill this area here. And then some. Oh, it's getting close. And one more in there. Okay, where are we going to put this extra keg? I don't know. I guess we can just put it over here too. This is as good a spot as any. There we go. So I can probably fill in all of this area over here as well. Since it's just going to be automated anyway. Okay, let's head outside. And it is a bad luck day. So we don't want to go into... I was hoping to go to Ginger Island. Into the volcano. Oh! Marlin's here. I looked over the monster parts you delivered. Great job. Meet me at the guild docks when you're ready. <gasps> yes! Oh my god, I totally forgot. I did that quest for Merlin to get access to his boat. Oh yeah. I'm excited to go to his boat. Hello, wife. I spent the morning repairing a few of the fences. This should be good as new. Oh, well, thanks, Leah. And let's check the mail. Linus sent us a Mackey roll. We'll take it. I'm not going to say no to a Mackey roll. I mean, I wish I could have Mackey roll in real life right now. Okay, so a lot of the crops have been harvested, but it's the 25th. So I'm not going to bother planting anything else right now. Check the grabber. We have some truffles in there. We'll take those out. I'm going to leave the other crop in there for now. Okay. And I'll grab the row and the crab pots. And we'll get these put into the processing station. Probably should have grabbed my... Grab my extra speed with my crab cake. But I didn't do that. That's fine. Let's put the truffles in here to be processed. And we'll put the trash in here. Okay, let's put a few more things away. And we'll get the row in. We can take these out and sell them. Okay, let's sell, sell, sell. Okay, I think I had these mushrooms so I can go to that but when I go to the highland. So this is perfect. I'm really excited to go see what it's like, but I'm kind of nervous because I've never done it before. Oh, I didn't put all the rope away. That's okay. We'll sell it. I want to clear out my inventory as much as I can. And I know there's going to be new fish, so I'm going to take my fishing rod. I'm also going to take the, the tackle, maybe. Let's see if there's any boost we can take with us. Mm, the fish taco is good. So is the fish stew. Let's grab a fish stew out of here. And what else should I take with me? Maybe should I take some spicy eel? A little extra speed and luck? Yeah, sure, why not? I'll take some bombs too. Oh my goodness, this is exciting. I probably should go check my greenhouse first before I pick up all these things and take them with me. Oh well, I already did it. It's in here now, so 
it's fine. Well, let's go over to the greenhouse. Let me grab the crab cake first, though. And we'll eat that. And over to the greenhouse we go. So this is a bad luck day, and we have to go into a new area with monsters on bad luck day. Ah, that is very scary. I, I'm going to grab some of these things out and sell them right away. Sell these stuff, I think. All of this I'm selling for sure. Sell. This for selling. That for selling. We'll have to come back. Okay, let me pop these in. Oops. Sell, 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 and sell, sell, sell. Okay, one more batch. I'm just gonna pick up the auto grabber just in case there's more stuff to be harvested. I oh, know there is not. Let's just check. Okay, so there's plenty of open spaces. One, two, three, four, five, six. There is seven open sprinklers. So we'll have to get those. Yeah, we got all the starfruits. So we'll have to get purchase some more seeds from Sandy. You know, I kind of thought I did go purchase seeds from Sandy already. But maybe I didn't. Um, I'm just going to sell the hops as well. Let me double check that I didn't actually purchase some seeds. It wouldn't be there. I did. I knew it. Okay, I'm going to go plant these seeds right now. And then we're going to head over to the highlands. Let's head over to Marlins, go through the mines, and see what this new area is all about. <gasps> Yay, Marlins down at his boat. Are you prepared? It'll be a long trip. I'm very prepared. All right, watch your footing when climbing onto the boat. <laughs> oh, where is this? This is definitely a new area I've never been to. Ah, that wasn't that long of a trip. We've arrived. How are you holding up, Melanie B? I think I'm fine. <laughs> Lance's outpost is just up these stairs. Oh my goodness. Ah! Whoa. Lance says nothing. Hello, friends. Welcome to my outpost. You must be exhausted after the long journey. It was uneventful, but that's a good thing in my book. Chuckles, of course. Please, come inside. I've prepared refreshments. There's much to discuss. Ooh, look at his bed. I like his bed. It's nice. My outpost may be small, but I assure you, it packs the necessary punch for surviving the highlands. The magical flames act as a form of monster repellent. I created them myself. Ooh. I'm conducting research out here on behalf of my master. There's something special about the monsters that inhabit this region. Although uncommon, some possess peculiar seeds ripe with abnormal arcane properties. 
Okay. Seeds, you say, as in crop seeds? Melanie B is an expert in that department. Thanks. <laughs> ah, yes, I'm quite aware of your endeavors, Melanie B. Allow me to share the knowledge I've gained from my research thus far. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Lance shared his findings with Marlon and I. He asked us to hunt highland monsters to obtain their strange crop seeds and to try cultivating them. So there's new crops to plant. Before I knew it, hours had passed by. It's now time to head back home. I wonder what's in store for me at the highlands. What? You don't get to explore it? But I wanna, exp I wanna explore. Can I go back there? I'm going back. <gasps> yes, I can. Okay, cool. So this is another cutscene. Welcome back, Melanie V. Thank you for assisting in my research. I've unfortunately had no luck growing the monster crops myself. From my observation, there's four types of seeds, each capable of growing a seasonal monster crop. Your cultivation skills are perfect for this quest. Okay. Where do I get these seeds? Can I chop these trees down? Monsters won't nest around my magic fire, but they can still chase you past them. If you must retreat, seek shelter in the outpost to shake off any aggressors. I mailed a crate of life elixirs to your farmhouse address. Whoa, it should arrive within the next day. They will aid in your adventures here. Best of luck. Well, thanks. Thanks, Lance. Okay, so let's go up here. Okay, let's get our sword out. And I'll move my mushrooms over here. Okay, let's go kill some monsters. Nothing so far. Ah! Oh my gosh, he came out of nowhere! Oh, they're hard. They're not like scary like the Badland monsters are. But yeah. Okay, they're not so hard. What did he drop? Oh, that was just a pine cone. <laughs> oh, they just come out, out of the floor, out of the ground. Okay. What are they dropping? It's like they're tree monsters. Hmm. Oh, I got a seed, a stalk seed. Can I plant that? Okay, I wonder if there are any monsters that are harder than these ones. Ooh, a slime seed. They kind of look like the seeds for the ancient, the ancient seed. Okay. I'm dying. I'm dying. No. Not today. Oh, I didn't need to. It's fine. Um, I wonder if there's any fish around here. Oh, there is. There's a new fish. Um... There's a 10% chance of catching it. I wonder if we can just fish in this water here. But that one's gonna come for me. Okay. Okay, so he's dropping like mixed seeds and fiber. So it's like he's a plant-based creature. Which is kind of neat. Look at all these slimes. Oh, another slime seed. They do hit pretty hard. Can I pick that up? Yeah, there we go. Let's go up here. It's scary because it kind of just pop out of the ground, so you don't know where they're going to pop up. 
so you can't really avoid them. Another seed, a stock seed. That one looks a little bit bigger. Okay, can we go up here? Yep. Yeah, I just have to chop down that wood that's in the way, I think. Let's call it a go. Okay, what is up this way? Okay, you can chop the trees down too. Let's take one more mushroom. And let's actually, ah, ah, swarm, swarm. It's not that bad. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's get back at our sword. Get out of here, baddies. Okay. Oh, there's another little cave area down there. Can I get down there? How do I get down there? Oh, I wonder if I can go around here. Yeah, I think I can. Ah. Okay. Um. Oh my gosh. I wish they wouldn't come up on the other ground so many at a time. <laughs> One more mushroom. Okay. So we can't go down this way. So let's come up here a little bit further. Okay, and we'll use our pickaxe to clear those away. Is there anything else up here? Let's go over here. It's a lot of rocks we're getting. Oh, I probably should have brought some sort of warp totem with me. I wonder if you can make a warp totem to get here. I wonder if there's going to be an obelisk to get here. That'd be cool. Or if there's going to be like some sort of access through your nexus point. But there's not really any spots on the nexus left where we can do that, I suppose. Let's take a mushroom. Even though these don't, like, they don't hit that hard, just how they swarm. And they just pop out of nowhere, they can definitely overwhelm you. Oh my gosh, why is there so many all of a sudden? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna move this here. Leave me alone, baddie. I just want to chop down these trees and clear a path. Okay, what's up this way? Okay, it's getting late and I haven't gotten very far. But I wonder if I fall asleep here, who's going to find me? I'm um, probably Lance, I suppose. I think I might end up falling asleep here because I don't know how to get back quickly enough. Oh, look how low my life was getting there. That was dangerous. <gasps> Ooh, what's this? Ah, run right away. <laughs> 
Another mushroom. Okay, we'll go back. Oh my goodness, there's so many of them all at once. Thankfully, they move pretty slowly. Let's get another mushroom layer. He's pretty difficult. Oh, got another seed. Wow, oh my goodness, he's taking a lot of hits. He's still not dead. What? Oh my goodness, look how close I was to death. <laughs> this guy is intense. I still haven't killed him. I wonder if it's even possible to kill him. Because I've been wagging at him for a while. And he's not dying. <laughs> Am I going to be able to kill him at all before I fall asleep out here? Oh my gosh, look at all this stuff he gave. Holy cow. A golden key. Maybe it'll work on a lock around here. An ornate treasure chest. Just a regular treasure chest. Oh, wow. And I got like five of those stock seeds. Plant these during summer. It takes 25 days. This one is planted in spring to take 13 days. I wonder if I can plant these in the greenhouse and they would still count. Uh, okay. Where else can we get before we pass out? Because we're definitely going to be passing out soon. Okay, can we get up here? What else is over this way? Nothing. Anything else up here? No, nope, it looks like this is the end of the road over here. Okay, so we'll head back this way. Not going to make it very far, but we'll go. And there we go, sleeping time. Just pass right out in the middle of this strange foreign area. Okay, we got some items sold for today. 30,000, okay. And let's see where we end up. So I'm assuming it's going to be someplace close to the lands. Oh, we ended up in our own bed. That's interesting. So someone found us and took us all the way back from the highlands and took us home. So we got a lot of stuff in our inventory. Let's go put some of this stuff away. And that mail we're not going to collect right now since we don't have any space. Um, I actually want to go get these planted in the greenhouse right now just to see how they work. I'm gonna take a little speed boost though. No need to go slow. Okay, let's see if we can just plop them straight into the ground here. That'd be nice if they work right in the greenhouse too. Oh, look at these ones are coming along nicely. Okay, let's plant this here. And. Oh, yeah, we can plant them in the greenhouse. Nice. That's good. So I'll plant the, all of them in here, I guess. 
what would I found? Um, there are just three of that one. Okay, so I'll grab this one over here, and I'll plant these ones here, and I'll water them right now. I'll have to get a sprinkler for this one. So I didn't get to do a whole lot of exploring when I was up there, so I have to go back for sure. <laughs> Definitely need to see what I'm going to do with this key. But let me go help ahead and collect what I found so far. I didn't mean to go outside, but I did. Um, I wonder if I should just sell this. I guess it's sold now. <laughs> I'll sell that, I'll sell that, and that. I'll sell this. We got a lot of fiber, but that's because those little creatures, the golem looking creatures, were dropping fiber. Okay, let's collect these. We got some ancient fruit. Very nice. I'm gonna sell these things. So it's Friday today, so I should definitely go see Krobus and purchase a new sprinkler since I actually need a sprinkler now. I can also make a sprinkler, I suppose, but you know, Krobus is way more convenient. Uh, sell, 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 and sell this, and that, and what else was available in there? I'll grab all of this stuff, let's go take the sweet gem berries for processing. I don't know when I'm going to stop processing the sweet gem berries. Eventually, I suppose, but not as yet. Okay, let's head over to the processing station and put some more of these, uh, the coffee and the ancient fruit in. Um, I'm just going to grab all of it out of there. One back for stacking. And do I have any? Nope, no more ancients. That's fine. Let's grab the row, grab bot stuff. I actually have to go back into the house and collect my coffee and Joja Cola and Iridium and say hello to my sweet little baby. Okay, this will go in there. We'll put this, this, and that as well. And we might as well take these items out and get them sold. And I think the preserved jars, I'm going to put these strawberries into them. Okay, so we'll sell this and that. Ooh, look at all that diamonds are ready. Yeah, preserve jars are pretty much empty. I'll stick that in there as well. Um... Let's put this, if I put it there, it's not, I might have to set this up for an automation to collect because I can just kind of stack it. Okay, let's make a chest. Where's my chest? Where are the chests? I thought they were like on the first page. <laughs> it is. I am just out of wood. Right. Okay, let's make a stone chest instead. There we go. That will work. Perfect. Okay, let's put some stuff away. Get the loot in here. I'll also put these into process. It looks like I'm out of coal. So I'll take the diamond out of there. 
Uh, we got tons of coal in here. I guess we can put some, move some over. We'll move a few pieces over. Got so much copper and gold. <laughs> Okay, let's get these in here. Okay, I'm going to take out a few more purple mushrooms. Get up to 50 again. Okay, so it's a good luck day. So it's a better day to go to the highlands. And first, I think I'm going to go run down and see... Oh, 24 life elixirs he sent me. That is super generous. And Merlin found us. Thanks, Merlin. Notice the chill in the air. It could just be the approach of winter, or it could be the tangle of a dark specter. Here to help us celebrate tomorrow's festival. Oh, it's Spirit Eve tomorrow. Definitely going to go to that. Because I want the golden pumpkins. Okay, let's collect our goodies from in here. Eight pieces of iridium. Very nice. And where is our little baby? Is she hiding in the bed again like last time? No, she isn't. Okay. Is she down here? Hello, my sweetie. Aw. You go ahead. Where is your mama? No mama here. She left for the day, I guess. Um, no, I don't want to throw my coffee away. Uh, I'll drink it after. Grab a crab cake. I probably should take one of these uh, Junimo chests up to the Highlands area. But let's go down and see Krobus, our friend. Oh, look. A little ostrich is so cute. <laughs> Okay, we'll head over to Krobus and purchase a new sprinkler. And then we can head up to the Highlands. I feel like we're supposed to be visiting people, but like all I want to do is go to the Highlands and see what's there. Hey Krobus, I will take this please. Is there anything else I can afford? Like this, no, no returns. Can't afford it just yet. Soon, though. Soon. It will happen. Okay, back to the farm we go. I still need a whole bunch more wood, but... Priority says, it dictates that I go to the highlands. I wonder if I went up to Magnus now, if it will give me a option to purchase another obelisk. That would be super cool. Let's grab the truffles out of here. I'll get that into process right now. Oh, I don't need to put it in here. This is not the right place. This is the right place. There we go. Got two more fairy stones. Put those away for Sophia's quest. Okay, so I'll go up through this area. I'm actually going to go over to the Badlands first. Because there is still a recipe I need to purchase. If the shop is open. No shop today. Okay, cool, but Camilla's here. Beautiful view from here, right? Sand, sand, and more sand. <laughs> Is it wrong that I think some of the monsters we fight are kind of cute? Not enough to take home or anything. <laughs> I mean, I don't totally hate the slimes. They're okay. Okay, let's go over this way. Okay, did I give two gifts to Lance this week already? I wonder if he likes life elixirs. 
I bet he probably likes those things that from his area. He already gave to them twice. Okay, let's head down to the boat. I love that we can access this boat now. Okay, up we go. So, let's see up this way what's going on. Okay, so this is where the lookout is. Let's check out Lance's digs. Can we go up here? Yeah. So it's just the top of the building. Okay. That's fine. And the barrel contains mana elixirs. Oh, what's this? It's a research novel Lance is writing. Oh, I can sleep here? What? I can just sleep here. I don't want to go to sleep right now, but, you know, if I get stuck, I'll just sleep in Lance's bed. No big deal. That's why it's there, right? <laughs> okay, let's come back down this way. So I went this way last time to the left. So let's head up instead. Is there anything new around this way? Uh, no, is there a path or anything that's hidden? Nope. Chop some of those trees. Ah! I forget. Monsters, right? <laughs> okay. I wonder if I can find some new monsters. But why don't I go ahead? Oh, I stacked my, my mushrooms. Well, it's a good thing I have these life elixirs. Okay. Ah! Swarming! Get away. Don't swarm me like that. I don't deal well with swarms. I oh, got a cold that time. Okay, let's see if we'll run this side. Okay. So I wonder why they call this area the Highlands. Where is it on the map of, like, Stardew Valley? How does it all fit in? I wonder if I can see it on the map. Hmm. Not really. I kind of want to catch some fish, but yeah, I just don't know when those monsters are just going to pop out at me. Let's give it a go. Maybe we'll get lucky and find something new. Like there is that new fish in there. Okay, that's just a sturgeon, but what did we get in the treasure chest? Ooh, a few different things. Come on, let me get that new fish. Oh, a train is passing. No, I don't want that. Am I going to have any luck with this, this new fish? Come on, I need some luck here. Oh, I'm using magic bait. That's probably why. Getting all these different options. Let me try putting... A regular bait on there. Oh, okay. So that new fish is requires me to have the magic bait on. Okay. Okay. Let's see what's up this way. Ooh, is this different water? I'm gonna put my magic bait back on. Okay, what's in here? Okay, so it still does have that special fish. So it's definitely a seasonal fish and it must be for the fall season. 
because right now it's fall. Well, it's not for the fall season. It has to be not for the fall season because right now it is fall. And it's not showing up during the fall. I don't want the sturgeon again. My tackle has worn out. Let's put another one on there. No, I can't fight with my iridium ores. Okay, let's actually go down this way. Because that's the way we went last time and it was a dead end. So I think maybe up this way is where we'll get to that cave-like area. Okay. Ah! So scary. Lots more rocks, though, which I'll accept. <laughs> I'll just clear it out. Okay, into the cave we go. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, there's different crap. Ah, ah, there's something shooting at me. Ah. Okay, they're kind of like the same monsters. Oh, what's in the rocks? That's pretty cool. I like that. Okay, what about over this way? It has a bad guy over here. It's hard to see though. It's really dark in this cave. But the ores are the same. Okay. So these are some of like Krobus's people here. And this crab is, I think it's a different crab. Oh, I got a void seed now. Oh, cool. Let's get this guy. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's a geode node. It looks like there's a little path up here. Okay, I think I should probably go ahead and take some life elixir. Yeah. These guys are so hard to see. Oh, it's a different crab. Nice. Oh, there's one. He's just hiding in the dark there. Oh my gosh, it's really dark right now. I'm scared again. When is my light coming back? Okay, there we go. This is quite a large mine. I'm not even fully getting to explore all the little area of it. I wonder if it's generated the same, if it's like different mine levels, like in the regular mines, or if it's always the same. Oh, I like these Omni Geode nodes. That's kind of cool. It's so dark in here, I can barely see these guys sneaking up on me. Ah, uh, oh, what is that? What is that? Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, let's. No! Don't turn off my lights like that. I can't see you. When it's dark, I should probably have a ring that does give me light. Oh my gosh, I'm running low on elixirs and I'm gonna fall asleep again soon. I don't think I can make it back to Lance's cabin. Is there anything else over here? There's so much. Oh, this one is like a golden rock crab. Cool. Um, let's get rid of these sap. I don't need it. 
oh my gosh the like the goodies in here it's incredible there's a lot of resources for sure no stop turning off the lights i can't see with the dark being here like stop that Oh, well, it looks like Marlon's gonna have to save me again. <laughs> yeah, he certainly used up a lot of life elixirs. But these monsters are really tough. They certainly hit very hard and it being so dark does not help one bit. Okay. Oh, I wonder if I, oh, I passed out. I probably can fish over here though. So next time I'm here, I'll have to try fishing. Let's see what we sold for today. Oh, we sold quite a bit. So that ornate treasure chest is worth 10,000 10, Gs versus the regular treasure chest, which is just 5,000. It's good. We'll take it. Overall, 228,000 Gs for the day. Well, that is it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching.